have a question for the panel. Manu and Arsenal, who has had a better season? Manu, that one, no doubt. I'll even say Manu. You guys had a, a, a very good run, but you want nothing. You have nothing. What right are you going to say that you were in second place? So uh, because overall, Manu has won silver way, they are better. Overall, overall, I'll go with Manu because. <laughs> Check, the, check, the check. This, 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 this is how I look at it, right? Ben, Ben, this is how I look at it, right? Arsenal, Arsenal played a very good Premier League season, right? Very good. In the beginning, they're on the table until the last the last days of the Premier League. In FA, I don't know how far they went. I don't even remember them in any... Maybe round, round, round four we or kicked, something. We kicked them out. We kicked them out. Okay. In, 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 in Carabao, in Karawa, I, I don't know where even they stopped. I don't remember where they were. Uh, in Europa, it was not close to even. It was it last sixteen. Arsenal stopped. I'm asking. It was last sixteen, gone. Mm, exactly. Gold. So the only pride you have, the only pride you have is the Premier League. But we're looking at it all over Europe competition. Right now, United is in the finals. What? FA. We won a trophy. In, in, in uh we we went up to what quarterfinals europa really if you if you if you're a football fan think out loud just stop supporting your team but support football i'm a man you fan i have but another I know, yes I... according according to, uh, according, according to according to football knowledge that's how you look at it but if you look at it at dream one day you guys are better than us Okay, I have another question. Ateta's first season, he won the FA Cup with Arsenal. He was number eight that season. And then Manu was number two. Which team had a better season that season? It was, it was Arsenal. It was in United. What did United win to, 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 to be a bit? Because that season... Didn't you guys get to the Europa final that season under Ole? Yes, we went, but did we win anything? Arsenal won FA. Did we win no, anything? But you got, you got to the Europa final, if I'm not mistaken. Right? Uh -huh. and that, uh -huh. that's but, we but did, the you see, they had a silver yes, wear. Who had the better season? In that season, in that season, in that season again. Silver wear. No, it's not silver wear. It's not silver wear. It's. Big that's what is 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 basing is is benchmarking <laughs> on silverware. That's that's no, that's all his argument. Benji, 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 Benji. Let me ask. Yeah? Let, let me ask for one thing. Arsenal has considered more goals than us this season. Do you know that? Now, the gear with our bad season of seven zero, the gear is going to take the golden glove. You see, you see how it is. But you can't compare it to that. The other one where you won FA and we're in Europa finals and in second place. You can't compare it to that. Mm -hmm. Still, we have a better Then I also have another there. ask. Yes, I still have another ask. Ateta and uh, Ten Hag, who is the better manager? I, 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 can't, I can't. Who's going to tell for me? I, 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 I can't say anything, but Ten Hag has just been there for eight months. It's coming to nine, so... Really, you can tell. Yes. 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 If you're benchmark, if you're bench, if you're benchmarking on trophy, I tell you on his first season, the worst season, he took a trophy at FA Cup. And if you look at that FA Cup, he beat Manchester City, he beat Chelsea. We have won the Carabao but, Cup. Tell me the teams you've beaten to win that Carabao. Uh, let see, Ten Hag has not even finished that season. What am I comparing? What am I, I, think, I comparing? I we have finished that season. season. Just like the argument yes, we had with you. You know, perhaps, listen, just like the argument I had with you about Pepe and Anthony. You said, ah, Pepe in his first season. Anthony has not finished the season. Even yesterday, he assisted. Now he has more assists mm. than what Pepe in the first season. But the season is not yet done. Are you sure you about mean? that? Yes. Are you sure about that? I am very about, sure about, about that. The oran... Benji, you have the internet there. Google and give us those stats. Patrick, you're I quiet. You want to say something. Here. Let me, I have internet here. You know me, I have Wi Fi. I can give to Patrick. He's very quiet. Pepe's first season is better than Anthony's first season, honestly. See, you're comparing Pepe, Pepe and, uh, and uh, Anthony. Anthony has not finished the season. Pepe was there for three years. Three years, three fucking years. I but am looking, I am lowering it down to one season. I am lowering it down to one season. Why are you bro? lowering to one season? Yet the guy is still around. What if he's going to have a better season next season? 
uh, Pepe is no longer at Arsenal. That's why we're using the first season. And why are we talking about someone who is not in Arsenal? He's an Arsenal player, but he's alone. <laughs> oh, so in his first season, yeah, mm. he had five goals um, in the Premier League, yeah? Yeah. Five goals in 31 appearances. And um, I'm looking for the breakdown. He had five goals and As six you're looking down. Six assists. Okay. If, as as Zazranix is looking for Anthony's numbers, if you're liking the content, make sure you subscribe to the channel. If you're new here, like it, <laughs> smash the like, like button as usual. Uh, comment, tell your friend about the pod as well. And you know, you can come getting through for the pod one of these days. It's getting, getting, heated getting, up. getting heated up and he's getting the stats. I don't know, Zazranix, why you're taking long or you've, or you've seen the stats and you don't want to come back with the results, you know. Uh -uh. I mean, I know my stats open. I don't have to even. <laughs> That's a lie. Open is a lie. <laughs> let me get, let me get open is a lie. Oh. Uh, Manchester City won their game earlier, three goals to zero, uh, comfortably. And then um, Spurs was beaten as well uh, by Aston Villa, 2 1. Spurs is really. Chelsea drew 2 2. Uh, I thought they were going to win that one, but then it ended up. Two, two. Actually, they came from behind against Nottingham Forest. And then, uh, which other game was very interesting? Crystal Palace won their game. They have been on some mad run. Eh? So, yeah, yeah they, they, beat, they beat Bournemouth. So, according to what I see, okay. Anthony has four goals and two assists. But that's wrong. Because uh, I know he has more than two assists. He, he, exactly. Even that, that's what I'm saying. But uh, this is what not ended. Yeah, you, guys are, you guys are trashing Google. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are so mean. Uh -uh. Go back and Google again. Use another browser. What was the appearance? What what was the appearance of what Pepe? In how many games did he appear? 31, 31. 31. So this guy has only 31. appeared in 23 games. 23 games. 23 games, four goals, mm -hmm. two assists. That is that is the assist in Premier League, but overall it has more. We are looking at the Premier League. We have we've also added uh, we're looking at the uh player. We are looking at the league. player playing for its club, whether Premier League or European League. He's playing for. Yeah, but even if he goes to, for, yes, if he, 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 he still goes to, if he still goes to the other leagues, Pepe still has more numbers in the first season. Uh, That's the thing. Now, now in the yeah, European but, League, Pepe. Pepe how many goals did Pepe score for us, you know, in any European league? Do you remember well, he scored Europe. two goals in one game Europe. in the Europa? He had numbers and assists as well, bro. You're saying two, two, <laughs> Let's you're not saying go two there. Game, which which he scored numbers? two in one game. <laughs> he scored, I don't want to Google because you've Googled and you guys are trashing Google. Because Google has said Anthony has two assists. <laughs> let's, let's move on. Let's move on. Bro. Let's move on. Uh, Oh what my god. Patrick? Patrick. Patrick has gone away. The heat is so much. <laughs> I think he got a phone call. So, so um, man, uh, I think you, you're running for the game for the basketball. Dranix has come. I wanted to give him the chance to laugh. Uh, you have a minute to laugh, banter, and then we can call it call this right now. Ford. <laughs> you're still looking for the numbers. You want to find the numbers they're looking at. Actually, I, ha I have it here, but it's not important anymore. Uh, the only the only thing I can say <laughs> is that it, 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 it was nice. It was nice having you guys in the season. You guys have a good, I had a good run, and you you you, you gave us a you know a lot of comedy. We laughed, we enjoyed ourselves, and we even laughed at you at the end. So who is that having the last laugh? Let me take some Coca Cola. Um, I think it's I think empty. <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's why I called you to laugh. <laughs> well, um, to be honest, <laughs> during, during the Brighton game, I, I, I honestly just wanted to die, but my dad was right next to me, and you know, it's, Mother's <laughs> Day. it's Mother's Day, so you have to also think of the fathers, and this man gave really? me you know, yeah, I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna do that in his face, but right now I just want to die. Like, honestly, <laughs> you guys, 
especially for the fans that kept you know the hope alive like hey we have a shot we have a shot bigger fish to fry the minute you, you lost to man city you should have known that it's done i i kept telling you tony like keeping hope alive is just gonna break your heart but you're like eh, eh. everton what what benji Be- benji they have they have some guy who is a motivational speaker is called rob Rob is always misleading all the Arsenal fans. He misled all of them. And they had this hope over here <laughs> to have a bigger fish to fry. Now this, there's an there's a Arsenal uh, fan called Troops. He, he, he came out I and said, you. I'm not eating fish anymore. I fucking hate fish. <laughs> <laughs> I know Troops. Troops is a mashup. Troops is such a mashup. Yeah. I know. So, Tony, Tony, um, sorry, Why is it so I gave you guys just to laugh? To enjoy <laughs> and the minute is done, yeah. The composer, the composer you have right now, if any of the Arsenal players had it, you guys would not be losing the way you've lost. <laughs> like you're very composed. Man. Letting us enjoy ourselves. We got you guys are panicking I'll, I'll after, end, one I'll, goal. after one goal. I'll end the pod on a high note that, that last season we bottled top four. The players were down, we came back stronger, we've come for the title, we bottled it. Now next season we won't bottle it again. That's how I'll end it. <laughs> you know, you know, the Arsenal project. There's some loopholes in there. Like if you're a genuine title contender, that you don't lose by a three goal margin when you're fighting for a trophy. You don't. At least two one. You show some fight, yeah. You don't be like things happen. Manu has ever lost three one in a final. Yeah, that's like you're missing my point. I'm talking about a league, yeah. You, things happen. Last, so that's what I'm trying to tell you. Uh, these things should not happen. The last time Man City lost by more than a one goal margin was was when was like in September. You get if we lose, it's like two one, one nil stuff like that. Yeah, but like there's so much. It's so uh, like man. Me, 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 I, feel, I feel like Ateta, Ateta made mistakes in uh in those those other games of West Ham. What he made his mistakes there. It was just arrogant around that time. And it felt like he was doing the right thing. And it felt like he was doing the right thing. He made the mistakes, and they are, it has costed you guys. So really, you can't you can't even blame the players. The players are good. It's just that he made mistakes. Yeah. You guys have paid for it, and we're here Arsenal laughing. We have to enjoy the laugh. Arsenal was too predictable. The time when Rhys Nelson scored those goals off the bench, that kid was supposed to start for some time. Rest mm-hmm. your big players. Like, show that the team is confident. But if you keep bringing the same squad over and over again, people figure you out and they will whoop your shit. And guys are fatigued. You can't blame Saka. You can't blame Odegaard. All your kids have turned up. To be honest, your your squad has outperformed themselves. Me, I'm proud of what those kids have achieved. And you just have to look at the structure and the coach and take a hard look at yourselves and, yeah, come back next season. Is Edu still there? Edu should go. Like... In Jan, you could have consolidated that team properly for a title run because you had the upper hand. You understand? Benji, right. Benji, Benji, you, you, you know the January window is very tricky, man. You know it. People, yeah, teams just, just don't so let their players go. When you're a title contender, bro, there's so many free agents that are just there, chilling. You know, you know how Arsenal ended, ended up with Trossard because they missed out on who? On, on, on Mudrik. You know, Arsenal ended up with Georgino. Uh, Brighton was not willing to sell Caicedo. You see, those are like some of the things. People don't let players leave in January. And he bought on Martinelli and even injured him. <laughs> and that was supposed to be a card. Uh, there were so many cards that were supposed to wow. be in that game. But, anyway. but that, that, was a tough, that, that was a tough game. You, 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 uh, you could also see it was a tough game. Spoiling it with cards will make it very wrong. There are some games whereby the ref is very careful. You know, there's a lot of tension. You just don't uh, splash cards anyhow to people like that. It, it will spoil the whole game. So you know, you know the first leg when Arsenal, when Arsenal beat them 3-0 at their home, Arsenal went all out. They had the ball. Okay, for some times in the game, but Brighton was having the ball, but Arsenal had a game plan of, you know, uh, doing the high press well, and they costed them. This time, uh, they had the chances Graham. to... to that was under Graham, right? That was still under Graham Potter. Yes. No, it was Dizabi, I think. It was Dizabi. No? I think it was, it was Potter. Graham. For real? Yeah. Mm. I, I'm I going to check was... that. I, I, believe, I believe it was Dizabi. Um, 
that's life, you know. <laughs> that's life. Things happen. Always a pleasure yeah. to have you guys on the pod. Benji, Dranix, late come up, pause. Pleasure you came in late. You've had your, you your with, you've had your last laugh. We came with uh, a structure. We let's hope. Follow it. <laughs> yes. So uh, we just went freestyle. So Dranix, I hope uh, Ten Hag has a process or a project. Otherwise, you're dead. We, we we have a project and it's coming next season. They are, they, they they sold the club to the wrong person though. They've sold it already. Money has been sold already. They there is a politics. They want to put out the the Qatar, Qataris out of the business. They want that the other funny American guy who bought uh, the French the French club. Which one is it? Remind me if you can. The guy is the one who's Please. going to be taking over with Glazers. The Glazers is not selling fully. Yeah, they're not selling fully, but uh, you know the thing is now the Qataris have o- offered six point seven billion. It's cash because United wanted six what? Six billion. Now they have offered six point seven as their last, but somehow they want to go with the other American. They want to put those guys out. So I don't, I don't know if there's a project. I, d- I don't, I don't believe there's a project. Those guys are just there for business. Anyway, that's that's a talk for the other pod, Benji. Since you're running. Uh, yeah. I'm going to say my favorite word. End the stream. 